cult member I.L. Bay has published an odd new video, apparently the property of the Gambian Radio and Television Service, the state-run propaganda program of the dictator and war criminal, the dishonorable Yahya Jameh. The video announces the formation of a ragtag, unofficially endorsed football soccer league in the Gambia. To add to evidence that Kenneth D. Jackson is a self-centered egomaniac, he distastefully named his own team the Ambassador Dr. Jackson Football Club. In the video, Mr. Jackson shamelessly exploits the youth of the Gambia to forward his own political agenda, stating that he wants to focus on promoting and positively impacting the young people of Gambia. Someone should write a book entitled Dictatorship 101 and make this the opening chapter. The amateur shot video shows footage of unrelated football players engaged in sports, wearing unrelated jerseys, and then cuts to an obscure video of Dr. Jackson standing with a small group of Africans, surrounding a small pile of cheap amateur football gear piled in the grass at what appears to be an SCEI One Blood facility in West Africa. The camera also zooms in to display a jersey, which proudly misspells the team name in classic Dr. Jackson fashion. The jer jersey reads, Ambassador Dr. Jackson FC. The video also associates Kenneth D. Jackson with President Jamey's treacherous counterpart, Ambassador Ansamani Jamey, who is now the center of a statewide scandal centered around his betrayal of President Jamey by embezzling and potentially undermining the state-run Gamtail propaganda machine. Many insiders now believe that Ansamana Jamey and his associates may now be in imminent danger of a state-endorsed assassination attempt of Ansamana and his associates. This development could bode poorly for Ambassador Jackson, who has closely affiliated himself with the junior Jamey and may also be a target for political retribution by the government. This video was released on IL Bay's thinly veiled SCEI One Blood Propaganda website, Baywatch. No other link to this video or any other evidence of its legitimacy as a reliable news report has been brought to the light. A preliminary search for the news reports of the GRTS website failed to turn up anything about the story from official GRTS sources online. Additionally, no telltale professional media trademarks were found in the video. No More One Blood has dispatched an official inquiry to the GRTS editor verifying the integrity of the video and will post the response positive or negative and amend this report to reflect accurately. If history is any clue, this is most likely just another in a long line of media frauds by SCEI One Blood founder and CEO Kenneth D. Jackson. Former members recall discussions with Kenneth D. Jackson during which the cult leader and con artist revealed his intentions to start a club for the purpose of gaining the public support of the people and to create a media and branding platform to endorse his own political and religious agenda through sports propaganda. This plot at the time was geared towards his operation in Liberia prior to his expulsion from that country. This journalist himself was a part of a team named Think Tank with the final name chosen by Kenneth D. Jackson being the One Blood Eagles. Now, due to the overwhelming success of the cult activist group No More One Blood, Jackson has begun distancing himself from the brand, likely leaving I.L. Bay to act as the fall man and scapegoat for the ensuing SCEI One Blood fallout, as he did with accused child molester Andre Rivera Fuentes, a high-level member of the Kenneth D. Jackson organization. Because no standard copyright notification has been included in the video, No More One Blood has republished the video at, a, at this link. If, as we suspect, the video was created by IL Bay or SEEI One Blood as a phony news report, we would expect to receive a copyright infringement from them, proving that the fraud was perpetrated by Dr. Jackson himself. Otherwise, we will be informed by the GRTS that the video is legitimate and will conform with all applicable copyright laws. In its current form, the video can only be reasonably considered a part of the public domain with no known author. SEEI One Blood International is a Bible-based cult located at 5 Joyce Drive in Macon, Georgia, which actively engages in blackmail, extortion, investment fraud, tax evasion, and is part of an ongoing FBI investigation.